the sun yeah. comes up time to get up sun goes down time to chill out go to yeah. bed yeah right? yeah um what are your thoughts on sunlight and other kinds of light like blue light well i mean i think that light is is one of the most important regulators of our uh it's our it's a most natural regulator of our circadian rhythm in our sleep mm -hmm. and it is the biggest you know poison uh or i would say it's the biggest sort of destroyer of our natural rhythm because now we've harnessed its power to basically take away our natural rhythms or to um confuse our natural rhythms so so our so the way our system you know that all uh many, many circadian rhythm systems work is that um, we are sensitive to the different spectrum that our that natural light gives us. And sort of the beginning of the circadian upstate is the marker of it is the type of light that we get in the morning, which has a lot of blue light in it. Mm -hmm. And that sends goes through the retina and it sends signals to the suprachiasmatic nucleus that it's time for the upstate, mm -hmm. right? It's, it's morning time. Yeah. Every It's like the conductor, ding, ding, ding start right, right? Um, and so all your systems are regulated by this burst of blue light that comes into your eyes um, and then naturally across the day the sun goes from having blue in it to having no blue in it and the spectrum changes to warmer lights like oranges and reds mm -hmm. um, and that signal of no blue light is the signal for the onset of melatonin mm -hmm. so those are that's kind of the natural state of things and when we were using older light bulbs, right, the tungsten light bulbs, those light bulbs were actually, they shared the spectrum of sunset. Mm. So they didn't have any blue light in them. They're very much like firelight, like they had the warms, yellows, and reds. And so for a long, long time, we were able to use light and not necessarily mess with our circadian rhythm that much, even though people were obviously staying awake longer and working longer. And that's part of, you know, the Industrial Revolution was like, creating longer hours of work real quick let me interrupt you was that on purpose that they made light like that or was it completely coincidental i think it was coincidental i okay. don't think that this was in any yeah there's no way that, no way you know because this is all very new very, news yeah. <laughs> um but what's interesting is the leds their main uh um uh peak of their sensitivity is in the blue, blue light light. spectrum yeah. right so what you find is when you have you know cells in the in the suprachiasmatic nucleus, they will respond to blue light and not even green light. Mm -hmm. You know, you like really specific spectrum um, will either inhibit melatonin or or, or let melatonin um, get released. Mm -hmm. um, and so, of course, the LEDs are a problem because this is where like every parking lot, every hotel, all the screens, right? They're filled with these LEDs because they're super highly efficient but they're also screwing with our natural systems. And um, so now we're in a state where we're, t you know, really have these messed up sleep, wake and arousal systems. Mm. Now, when it comes to phones, I think that's a big issue, right? It's like everyone's on their phone and at night, you know, checking social media, doing whatever it is that they're doing. Based off of that, I mean, like when, when do you stop using your phone? Well, there are, I mean, you know, you could stop using your phone at 6 p.m., but that's, no one's going to do that. Right. So, so there are some, you know, the blue light blocking glasses that mm -hmm. are like, you know, the one that I actually like, and I, and I have no stake in this company, but they actually have research, and I do think that their research is pretty robust, is the Swanwick glasses, and the Swanwick glasses are yellow lenses, mm -hmm. and they block blue light, and I use them, and um, because the research is there, that it, they really do, you know, in decrease sleep fragmentation and they seem to increase well-being um, during the day so I think that you know you can st you know if, if, if it's impossible to not use screens then you really need to be using screens under blue light blue blocking light. conditions yeah Swanwick yeah can you spell that Swan like the bird Wick W-I-C-K all right awesome Swanwick support the pod <laughs> that's right send us some product <laughs> um so but you mentioned melatonin though yeah um do you, what do you think about melatonin supplementation for people at night that are having difficulty sleeping 